And we start here at five with this story caught on camera. A local teacher's tirade about kids right in front of her class full of middle schoolers. At one point, the teacher says she wished she could bring a gun to school to intimidate kids. Fox 26's Matthew Seedorf live outside Wright Junior High School in Richmond in Fort Bend County with a disturbing video. Matthew. Rashi, it's the teacher tantrum a lot of people are talking about. Some parents think this teacher needs to be fired. If I have to keep dealing with kids that are complete and utter morons, I'm done. Shocking moments inside a Houston area classroom. Like, I don't even care if I lose my job. I want to be fired at this point. Parents posting a student's disturbing video to Facebook. I literally am going to hurt myself if I have to keep coming here. A teacher at Wright Junior High School loud and clear on a major rant in front of her class full of sixth graders. That if they fell into a river, I would let them float away. Literally. See ya. Can you throw a log? Nope. I might throw a log on them. So they sink. No, I can't even I can't even understand why she would say the things that she said. Very cruel. Very uh not remorseful at all. Being a teacher is pretty frustrating, but taking it out on your students. You, you just can't do that. We showed this video to Diane Skypel. Her daughter's in the teacher's class. I want to carry a gun on my hip and intimidate people. Well, she needs to find a definite different profession um, than working with kids. You probably shouldn't talk to your students like that, even if you're really mad at them. Did she ever uh, say anything like that while you were in the class? No, but she actually did tell us about it, and she said she hopes she gets fired because she can't deal with it. A spokesperson from Lamarck ISD calls the comments disturbing, adding the employee involved was made aware not to report to the campus and was placed on administrative leave. Definitely, I would like for her to be fired. Uh, she doesn't have any experience professionally, obviously, with children. A lot of parents clearly upset. A spokesperson from the school district says this case is under investigation. We're live in Fort Bend County tonight. Matthew Seedorf, Fox 26 News.